Hi, this is Dean Morgan, and I'm coming to you from the Morgansoft Travel Channel. And we're here to get, take you on a road trip uh, through the South today. Cleo will be your tour guide for this adventure, and we hope you enjoy it. Thank you, Dean. My name is Cleo, and I will be your tour guide. Let's start this scenic road trip with travels through the beautiful states of South Carolina, Georgia, and North Carolina. In this video, we will explore some of the most charming and historic places in the southeastern coast and the Appalachian Mountains. We will start our journey in Columbia, the capital of South Carolina, and head south to the Lowcountry, a region known for its marshes, islands, wildlife, and culture. Our first stop is Charleston, one of the oldest and most picturesque cities in the country. Charleston is famous for its antebellum architecture, cobblestone streets, horse-drawn carriages, and southern hospitality. You can spend a day or two wandering around the historic district, visiting landmarks such as the Battery, Rainbow Row, the French Quarter and the City Market. You can also take a boat tour to Fort Sumter, where the Civil War began, or a plantation tour to learn about the history and legacy of slavery in the area. From Charleston, we drive to Beaufort, another charming coastal town with a rich history and a vibrant art scene. Beaufort is the second oldest city in South Carolina and the birthplace of the Gullah Geechee culture, a unique African-American heritage that developed in the Lowcountry. You can explore the historic downtown, admire the antebellum mansions, visit the Penn Center, the first school for freed slaves in the South, or join a Gullah tour to experience the music, the food, and stories of this fascinating community. Our next destination is Hilton Head Island, a popular resort town with miles of sandy beaches, golf courses, bike trails, and nature preserves. Hilton Head Island is a great place to relax, enjoy the sun and the sea, and indulge in some fresh seafood and local cuisine. You can also take a day trip to nearby Savannah, Georgia, another historic and charming city with a lot of character and charm. We leave Hilton Head Island and cross the border into Georgia, the largest state in the southeast and the home of Atlanta, the capital and the largest city in the region. Atlanta is a modern and dynamic metropolis with a lot of attractions, such as the Georgia Aquarium, the world of Coca-Cola, the Martin Luther King Jr. National Historical Park and the CNN Center. Atlanta is also a cultural hub, with a vibrant music, film and art scene, and a diverse and cosmopolitan population. From Atlanta, we head north to the mountains, where we will find some of the most scenic and natural places in the state. Our first stop is Dallanaga, a small town with a big history. Dallanaga was the site of the first major gold rush in the US, and you can still see the evidence of the mining era in the historic buildings museums and mines. You can also enjoy the quaint downtown, the wineries, the festivals and the outdoor activities, such as hiking, biking, kayaking and fishing. Our next destination is Brassdown Bald, the highest point in Georgia at 4,784 feet above sea level. Brassdown Bald offers spectacular views of the surrounding mountains and valleys, and on a clear day, you can see four states, Georgia, North Carolina, Tennessee, and South Carolina. You can reach the summit by hiking a steep trail or taking a shuttle bus, and visit the visitor center and the observation tower. From Brassdown Bald, we drive to Blue Ridge, a charming mountain town with a lot of charm and personality. Blue Ridge is known as the gateway to the Blue Ridge Mountains, a subrange of the Appalachian Mountains that stretches from Georgia to Pennsylvania. Hey everyone! Morgan Soft here, asking you to like and subscribe. Blue Ridge is a popular destination for outdoor lovers, with plenty of options for hiking, biking, horseback riding, zip lining, and more. You can also take a scenic train ride on the Blue Ridge Scenic Railway, or explore the downtown area, with its shops, galleries, restaurants, and breweries. We now enter North Carolina, the northernmost state in our road trip and the most populous in the southeast. North Carolina is a diverse and beautiful state, with mountains, beaches, 
forests, lakes, and cities. We will focus on the mountain region, where we will find some of the most stunning and scenic places in the country. Our first stop is Cherokee, a town located in the Kuala Boundary, a territory of the Eastern Band of Cherokee Indians. Cherokee is a place where you can learn about the history, culture and traditions of the Cherokee people, who have lived in this area for thousands of years. You can visit the Museum of the Cherokee Indian, the Oconalufti Indian Village, the Kuala Arts and Crafts Mutual and the Unto These Hills Outdoor Drama. You can also try your luck at the Harris Cherokee Casino Resort, or enjoy the nature and wildlife at the Oconalufti River Trail and the Mingo Falls. From Cherokee, we drive to the Great Smoky Mountains National Park, the most visited national park in the U.S. and a UNESCO World Heritage Site. The park covers over 800 square miles of mountains, valleys, forests, rivers and waterfalls, and is home to a rich biodiversity of plants and animals. You can explore the park by driving along the scenic Newfound Gap Road, hiking on the many trails, such as the Appalachian Trail, the Clingman's Dome Trail and the Laurel Falls Trail, or camping at one of the campgrounds or backcountry sites. Our next destination is Asheville, a vibrant and eclectic city in the heart of the Blue Ridge Mountains. Asheville is known for its artsy and bohemian vibe, its craft beer scene, its farm-to-table restaurants and its historic architecture. You can spend a day or two exploring the downtown area, with its shops, galleries, cafes and street performers, or visit some of the attractions, such as the Biltmore Estate, the largest privately owned house in the U.S., the North Carolina Arboretum, a botanical garden with over 65 acres of plants, and the River Arts District, a former industrial area turned into a creative hub. We leave Asheville and drive along the Blue Ridge Parkway, one of the most scenic and famous roads in the U.S. The parkway is a 469-mile-long route that connects the Great Smoky Mountains National Park in North Carolina with the Shenandoah National Park in Virginia. The parkway offers stunning views of the mountains, valleys, forests and meadows, and has many overlooks, visitor centers, hiking trails and historical sites along the way. Some of the highlights of the parkway include the Lynn Cove Viaduct, a curved bridge that wraps around the Grandfather Mountain, the Linville Falls, a three-tiered waterfall that plunges into the Linville Gorge, the Moses H. Cone Memorial Park, a former estate with a mansion, a lake and a craft center, and the Blowing Rock, a rock formation that creates a strong upward wind. We end our road trip at the northern terminus of the parkway, near Waynesboro, Virginia. From here, you can continue your journey to other destinations, such as Washington, D.C., Baltimore, Philadelphia or New York, or return to Columbia, South Carolina, where we started. We hope you enjoyed this scenic road trip through the South, and we hope to see you again soon. Thank you for watching, and safe travels. Back to you, Dean. Thanks, Cleo. And thank you, the viewer, for watching until the end. We appreciate you and would ask that you like this video and subscribe to this channel. This is Dean Morgan from the Morgan Soft Travel Channel. Thank you and we hope to see you again.